Welcome to Move and Shout. My name is Lauren Lewis with uh, Power for Parkinson's. Everything we're going to be doing for the, the remainder of this exercise session will be very intentional, large moves. We want to make sure that everything you're doing is large and intentional and uh, with a lot of dynamic moves. So that said, we're going to get started. We're going to start off with um, bringing your arms out directly in front of you. You want to open up those fingers as wide as possible. We're going to open and close those hands, tight, tight fist and wide fingers. We're going to do that four times together while we say the words close, open. So together we go. Close, open, close, open, close, open. Last one and open. Good. Take out those, shake out those hands. Bring them directly overhead. Big stretch all the way down. And let's do that one more time all the way up. Try to lengthen those arms as much as possible. Keep them all the way up, lengthening the elbows, lengthening the entire upper body. We're going to take one breath, one breath only. Lowering the arms, we're going to save the letter A for as long as that breath will allow. When you're done, we are done with that particular exercise. So together, breathe in, lower those arms, A. So what we're working on here is vocal power, warming up our vocal cords, as well as full body stretching and lengthening, warming up. So let's bring those arms directly overhead again. This time we're going to change the facial expressions and say, ooh, we're going to drop the eyebrows using many more uh, muscles in the face. Inhale deeply. Ooh. All right, great job. Let's do one more. This time we're going to open up nice and wide and say, ah, try to use every muscle in your face, lifting your eyebrows, widening your mouth. Arms overhead for the last time. Ah. Woo. All right. Moving on, let's continue our warm-up. Hands are on your shoulders. We're going to reach really, really high and then bring those arms directly down. And we say together, up, down, up, down. Bigger, up, down again, up, down. Two more, up, down. Last, up and hold. This time we're going to stretch those arms directly in front. Full extension of the arms, fingers are open. We're going to bring those arms back in a tight fist and back. So together we say, front, back, front, back, front, back, front, back. Two more, back, last one, and hold. We're going to put those two exercises together. Up, down, front, here we go. Up, down, front, back, up, down, front, again. Up, down, front, one more, go up. Down, front, and hold. Good. Now we're going to extend the arms to the side, lengthening those arms all the way out. And we're going to bring them all the way back into your side. So we go out, in, out, in, out. Throw those arms nice and big and go out, in, out, in. Two more. Last one. Go out and in. Good. All right. Let's put those three exercises together. Up. Down, front, back, out, in. Up, down, front, back, out, in. Up, down, front, back, out. One more. Up, down, front, back, out, and hold. Good. Now we're going to cross the midline. We're going to go right through the center of our body uh, using your shoulder, your arms, your core, crossing the midline of your body. And we're going to say, Cross, cross, here we go. Cross, 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 strong. Cross, 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 four more. Cross, cross, two more, cross, and hold. We're going to put all those together in our warm up. So we'll go up, down, front, back, 
up, in, cross, cross, go up, down, run, back, up, in, cross, again, go up, down, run, back, up, in, cross, last time, go up, down, run, back, up, in, cross, and cross. Nice work. Just shake it all out. Just warming up, getting that blood flowing. Continuing on, we're going to warm up our shoulders. We're going to go right and left together. Right, left. Separate your shoulders. Right, left, right, left, right, left, right, left. Again, right, left, last one, and hold. Good. And again, just keep rolling and moving getting everything nice and warmed up. We're going to warm up the neck. This is important. We want to keep your, uh, turn, being able to turn your head separately from turning your entire upper body. So I'm going to ask you to turn your head all the way over your left shoulder. And then turn your head all the way over to your right shoulder. And together we're just going to go left, right, turn, left, turn, right, again, left, Turn right, two more, left and right, last time, left and right. Good, now we're going to just work on just a nice more, uh, more fluid motion. So I'm going to have you just do big circles all the way around from your left to your right, and north and south, just keep going all the way around. And then again, just reverse that head motion so we're warming up and getting that neck warmed up without using any other muscles. All right, continuing on, we want to warm up our core. So we're going to start with the twisting motion. Hands are on your shoulders. We're going to twist and turn, looking over your right shoulder, right, and then come back to center, and then twist using your core over your left. If you have any type of back injury, you may not want to twist. You may want to reach over to your right, turn your head, and come back, and then go to the left and turn, just to keep safe and, and uh, for that lower back. So otherwise, we're going to turn together, right, center, left, center, turn, right, center, turn, left, now nice and big, nice and big, right, center, turn, left, two more, turn, right, center, turn, left, last time, big, right, center, and left, all right, we're going to continue warming up that core. I'm going to have you lie all the way back in the back of your chair, extending your legs. Please make sure that you are stable. We don't want to lose you on the floor. So you're sitting nice and uh, stable on the chair, but you're leaning back. I'm going to bring your hands up by your, shoulder, your shoulders. You're going to pull your belly in nice and tight and try to lift your shoulders off the back of the chair. Just to a full seated position, not farther than a full seated position. We're going to lean back, and this time we're going to use our vocals in a very low part of the range. And we're going to gro uh, just groan. Uh. Good. Lean all the way back again. Make sure you're using your abdominals. You're pulling in, and together we go. Uh. Good. Let's do that four more times because it's fun. Uh. Three more. Uh, last two. Uh, last one, this time in slow motion. Here we go. Uh, all right, so we got that core nice and warmed up. Now that we're warmed up, we can sit nice and tall. Feet are directly, directly in front of you. On the floor, we're going to warm up the legs. And we're going to lift one leg at a time off the floor as if you were just marching in place in your chair. So try to lift that leg nice and high, one at a time, in slow motion, nice and slow. Good. Now we're going to add the opposite arm as if we were walking in place. You want to make sure when that right leg is up, the left arm is up, and then we switch left arm, right leg, and then we switch and switch. And if this is easy for you and you don't find this uh, too challenging, you can add a twist in the upper body looking behind your, the arm that's behind you, just looking, following that arm. So we're adding a natural twist in your upper body while we're lifting opposites, right and left. And we're just going to warm this up a little more, and then we're going to put this together. Good. All right. So now we're going to add more of a vocal 
more vocal power, more vocal exercises we'll get to this exercise. We're going to lift the right leg, and I'm going to ask you to trigger that right leg so your right leg is ready to go. And then we're going to use our left arm working opposite. And then we're going to use our full range of vocal power. We're going to start way down here, and we're going to sing up, 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 up. And then we're going to sing as we lower down, 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 down. Left arm together. Up, 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 down, 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 switch. Up, 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 down, 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 down. Nice work. Now we're going to take it to a gentle jog. Just jogging in place, one leg at a time. Try to lift them separately. Try to add some gentle arm. We're just jogging all the way over to our starting position. And then we're going to go as fast as we can, as hard as we can, now that we are warmed up in those legs, for 10 seconds while we count to 10. When I say go, as hard and as fast as you can. Go! One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Everybody moan. Ugh. Now we're going to find that upper uh, upper part of our vocal cords. Now we're going to everybody sigh. Ah. Moan. Ah. We're going to try that jog one more time, a gentle jog. Ten seconds, full out run. Go! One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Moan. Ah. All right, moving on, let's warm up those ankles. This is really important for gait. We want to make sure that we're able to lift those toes so that we don't shuffle our feet when we walk. We want to make sure we have a lot of flexion in those ankles. So we're going to start off with that right toe, and that right toe is going to lift up eight times. Then we're going to move over to the left toe, and the left toe is going to lift up eight times. So here we go. One, two, three, four, nice and high. Six, seven, and switch. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, and switch. One, two, three, four, nice and high. Six, seven, and switch. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. All right, so um, we're going to move on and warm up our brain. Um, make sure to take water, um, when, not just after, but also during. Whenever you feel like you need a little sip, please feel free, grab some water throughout. So I'm going to stand up now so you can see me better. And we're going um, to be working on wrists, fingers, hands, and brain memory. So if I say uh, thumbs up, you're going to make a tight fist and bring those thumbs up. If I say thumbs down, tight fist, thumbs down. And again, everything is exaggerated and intentional. So your arms are fully extended in front of you. If I say palms up, your palms are up. If I say palms down, you're going to drop those palms down, but keep your arms fully extended. And if I say flip, you're going to do whatever it was and flip it. So whatever it was. So we're going to start off with the right hand and the right thumb, rather. The right thumb is going to go down. And then the, right, the left thumb is going to go up. So let's shake it out and put those two together. Down, up. Good. Shake it out one more time. Down, up. I'm adding on now. I'm going to take my left hand and go down. So it's. Down, up, down. Again, down, up, down. One more time. Down, up, down. Adding, up. Down, up, down, up. Down, up, down, up. I'm going to add this time. Down, up, down, up, flip. Here we go. Down, up, down, up, flip. Again, down, up, down, up, flip. So far, so good. Let's try that one more time. Down, up, down, up, flip. And I'm adding up. Palm is up. So here we go. Down, up, down, up, flip, up. Again. Down, up, down. Up, flip, up. I think we're getting it. Down, up, down, up, flip, up, adding up. So we have both arms, arms extended and palms are up.
Put it together. Down, up, down, up, lift, up, up. Again. Down, up, down, up, flip, up, up. Good. One more time. Down, up, down, up, flip, up, up. I'm adding again. Down. And you can lower that voice too and use it different parts of your vocal range. So together we go. Down, up, down, up, flip, up, up, down. Again. Down, up, down, up, flip, up, up, down. One more time. Down, up, down, up, flip, up, up, down. I'm adding up. Here we go. Down, up, down, up, flip, up, up, down, up. Again. Down, up, down, up, flip, up, up, down, up. Last time, I'm going to speed it up a little. Here we go. Down, up, down, up, flip, up, up, down, up. Nice job. All right, yay. All right, so let's move on. We're just going to warm up those fingers and get, get, uh, get started. So start off with that right hand. I have you touch each finger one at a time. So we're going to touch pointer. We're just going to count to uh, four and back. One, two, three, four. Then we go back. Four, three. Each finger is touching. Two and one. Make sure your hands are fully extended and those fingers are open. So again, we go one, two, three. Open up those fingers. Four, four, three, two, one. One more time. One, two, three, four. Back. Four, three, two, and one. Switch hands. Left hand. One, two, three, four. Back, four, three. Open up, two, and one. Again, one, two, three, four, four, three, two. Let's do that one more time. One, two, three, four, four, three. Two, one. Good. Shake it out. I'm going to start off with the right hand. Right hand's going to start with your pointer. We're going to do exactly what we just did. And then we're going to add the left hand, though. And the left hand's going to start with the pinky. And you can sigh right now or moan. It will both will not help. <laughs> so here we go. One, two, three, four, four, three, two, one. One. Two, three, four, four, three, two, one. One more. One, two, three, four, four, three, two, and one. Shake it out. Great job. All right, we are moving on. I think we have warmed up everything where we can. So <laughs> we're going to start uh, off with a, a total body um, exercise. We're going to add a different ex uh, an additional exercise to each exercise, we're going to do add-ons. So I'm going to give you one exercise, we'll work on that. We'll add another one and put it and start from the beginning. The first exercise is nice and easy. We're going to march using the entire body. So we're going to start off with that right leg. We're going to add the arms, then we're going to march counting. Um, every time we land that right leg down, we're going to count a number. So it's one, two, three, four, five, six, Seven and eight. Again, one. A little bigger. Two, three, four. A little bigger. Five, six, seven, eight. Again, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One more time. Go. One, two. Nice and big. Three, four, five, six, Seven and hold. All right, so the next exercise we're going to add to that is a large, big extension of both your right, of your right side, arms and legs. Out, out, and then we bring them in, in. So it's out, out, in, in. Go out, out, big, in, in. Again, out, out, in, in. Again, out. Out, 
in, one more, go, out, out, in, and in. Good, and we're gonna put those two together. We're gonna count to eight marches on the right leg every time we bring, we bring the right leg down. We count, and then we add on the out, out. So here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Out, out, in, in, go, out, out, in. Two more times, go, out, out, in, in. Last, out, out, in, and march. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Out, out, in, in, out, out. In, again, go out, out, in, last time, out, out, in, and hold. All right, shake it out, grab some water as you need it. I'm adding on another exercise. Now we're going to use opposites. So we're going to take that right arm and go out, and that left leg, out. And this is, we're going to do a little faster, so we're going to do each side twice. Out, in, out, in, switch, out, in, out, in, right, out, in, out, switch, out, in, out, again, go out, in, out, in, out, in, out, again, out, in, out, in, out, in, out, all right, so we've got three exercises. We start with marching, we add out, out, in, in, and then we go opposite sides, out, in, out, in. So let's start with the march eight times together. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Out, out, in, in, again, out, out, in, opposites. Out, in, out, in, out, in, again. Go, out, in, out, in, out. In march. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Out, out, in, in, again, out, out, in, opposites. Out, in, out, in, out, in, out, in, out, in, out, in, out, in. Great. All right, I'm adding on again. Grab that water as you need it. The next exercise is a full extension up to the ceiling. Down, full extension front and back. So it's up, down, front, back. Up, down, front, back. Big up, down, front, back. Up, down, front, and hold. I'm gonna add on to that because that's just the upper body. The lower body is gonna be going heel, toe, heel, Toe. So we go heel, toe, heel, toe, heel, toe, heel, toe, heel, toe, heel. Add the arms. Up, down, front, back. Up, down, front, back. Up, down, front, back. Go up, down, front. Two more times. Go up, down. Front, last one, up, down, front, and hold. All right, we've got four exercises. March, out, out, in, in, right, opposites, left, opposites, and then up, down, front, back. Let's put it all together, march. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, out, out, in. Again, out, out, in, opposites. Out, in, out, in, out, in, again. Go, out, in, out, in, out, in, up. Up, down, front, back. Up, down, front, back. Up, down, front, one more. Up, down, front, march eight, one. Two, three, four, five, six, 
seven, eight, out, out, in, in, out, out, in, opposite, out, in, out, in, out, in, again, go, out, in, out, in, out, in, reach, up, down, front, back, up, down, front, back, up, down, front, and last one, up, down, front, and hold. All right, we've done a lot of large, big motions. I'm going to add a pattern. This is really just more for memory, for cognition. So it's snap. If you can't snap, you can still do this. So it does, if you're not going to snap, just bring your hands together. So it's snap, snap, down, up, clap, stomp. If you can't lift both legs, that's okay. You can stomp your heels or stomp one leg. So here we go. Snap, snap, down, up, clap, stomp. 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 Snap, snap. Down, up, clap, stomp, snap, snap. Down, up, clap, two more, snap, snap. Down, up, clap, last snap, snap. Down, up, clap, march. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Out, out, in, in, out, out. In, opposite, out, in, out, switch, out, in, again, switch, out, in, out, in, out, in, up, up, down, front, back again, up, down, front, back again, up, down, front, last time, up, down, front, pattern, snap, snap, down, up, clap, stomp, snap, Snap, down, up, clap, stomp, snap, snap, down, up, whoop, snap, snap, down, up, clap, stomp. All right, I've got one more piece to add. Grab some order, because this one's fun. <laughs> we're going to take, we're going to take that right elbow. Opposite, we're crossing it. You don't have to touch the knee, we just have to go opposite to the opposite leg. We're going to go three times. Three times, one, two, three, and on the fourth one, we're going to give a big kick and use our vocals slightly differently. We're gonna go, whoo! So it's one, two, three, whoo! Switch, one, two, three, whoo! One, two, three, whoo! One, two, three, whoo! Bigger, one, two, three, Woo! One, two, three, woo! Last one, two, three, and woo! All right, here we go. We're going to put it all together from the very top. March, out, out, in, in, opposites, up, down, front, back, our pattern. I hope I get it. And then crossing three with a big kick, crossing three with a big kick. Here we go together. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Out, out, in, in, out, out, in, opposite. Out, in, out, in, out, in, again. Out, in, out, in, out, in, arms up, up, down, front, back, up. Down, front, two more times. Go up, down, front, last one. Up, down, front, pattern. Snap, snap, down, up, clap, stomp, snap, snap. Down, up, clap, two more, snap, snap. Down, up, clap, last, snap, snap. Down, up, clap, and one, two, three, Woo! One, two, three. Woo! One, two, three. Woo! Last one. One, 
two, three. Woo! All right, great job. All right, again, please make sure to keep yourself hydrated, grab some water. We're now going to be working on getting out of the chair and sitting down. And then we're going to stand up and do some standing exercises. So make sure that your area in front of you is clear. Make sure that you are sitting nice and tall. I'm going to ask those of you, if you are a righty, if you are more right dominant, you're going to take that right leg and bring it at a 90 degree angle in front of you. The other leg is on your side. Your hands are on your knees so that you have leverage to lift. You want to make sure that your head is nice and high. You drop your head down, you may follow down, keeping your head high. If you are left dominant, left sided, left leg, then you bring that left leg in front. Everything else is the same. Your hands are on your, on your knees for leverage, and you're going to push on your heels. Pushing on your heels is key. On your heels, not your toes, and lift. So choose which is best for you. I'm going to go over here on the right side. Hands are on my thighs. We're going to go halfway up and down, and then we're going to go all the way up. Legs are nice and wide, stabilizing our body, making sure that you are stable. Hips directly underneath you. Be careful that you're not standing halfway all the way up and then we're going to sit. We're going to do that four times together. So hands are in place, your legs, all your weight is on your heels. If you are not getting out of your chair, that's fine. You can still join us by leaning forward and back, shifting your weight forward <coughs> off the chair and back. You do not have to get out of the chair. You can still work on these motions and all these uh, muscles with us without getting up. So together, hands are down, head is up, heels are Pushing, and we go halfway and down. All the way. Pushing down, come up. Good, make sure those hips are forward. And down. Let's try that again. Halfway and down. Go at your own pace, all the way. Head up, head up, head up, hips underneath you. And down. Let's try that two more times. Halfway. And down, all the way up. Legs are wide, hips are underneath you, and down. This time, if you're going to stay standing, I'm going to ask you to just hold in place. If you're not getting up, stay where you are. The next exercise can be done seated as well as standing. So halfway, halfway. And those of you that are going to stand up all the way, come all the way up. And find your stability. Gently march your legs right, left, just again, working on shifting your weight. When you feel like you are stable, we're just going to take those legs, march them a little closer together, and go to the back of your chair. You want to make sure that you are stable. So I'm going to ask you to have a chair near you and to hold on to everything. I'm going to be on the side of the chair so you can see me better, but you can be behind your chair. We're going to be working on shifting weight. We're going to be working on heel toe and balance. So this can all be done seated or standing. If you are seated, here it is. It's heel, toe, heel, toe three times. Heel, toe, lift, and down. Same side, heel, toe, heel, toe, heel, toe, lift. And if you're standing, two hands or one hand on the chair until you feel stable, and we go heel, toe, heel. Toe, heel, toe, lift, and down. Again, heel, toe, heel, toe, heel, toe, lift. Now that you understand what we're doing, if you want, you can take a little less weight off, a little more weight off that chair. Maybe just have one finger. Or if you're really feeling stable, you can take both hands off and use your body weight forward and back. To make it a little more challenging, really shift your weight on that hold. Get that chair nearby as you need it. So here we go together. We go heel, toe, heel, toe, heel, toe, lift, down, front, back, front, back, front, back, up, again, front, back, front, back, front, back, up, one more. Front, back, front, back, front, back, up. Great. Let's take it over to the other side and see how we work on that side. 
One last thing I didn't mention, and that is if you're not holding on and you want to challenge yourself a little more, we're working opposites. So when that leg, uh, when your left leg is forward, your right leg, arm would be forward and back. So we're going to do three front back, one knee together. Front, back, front, back, front, back, up, down, front, back, front, back. Front, back, up, down, front, back, front, back, front, back, up. One more, front, back, front, back, front, back, up, down. I'm going to take it back over to that right side. We're going to add a little more to this. We're going to tap that toe out to the side. And this is where I really want to make sure that you're holding on for balance and for stability until you understand what we're doing. We're going to tap out to the side and then cross in front. That's going to change your balance. That's going to change your stability. So be very careful. So together we go three times and a knee. Out, cross, out, cross, out, cross, up, down, out, cross, out. Cross, out, cross, up, down, out, cross, out, cross, out, cross, up. One more, out, cross, out, cross, out, cross, up, down. Good. Shake it out a little. Let's put that together. Right leg leads. We're going front back first together. Front, back. Front, back, front, back, up, down, out, cross, out, cross, out, cross, up, front, back, front, back, front, back, front, back, up, down, out, cross, out, cross, out, cross, up, down. Left side. All right. Get those legs moving. Here we go. We're going to start off with that side, work on, working on that side tap. Hold on when we initially start this, just so that you understand where your stability is. And we go out, cross, out, cross, out, cross, up, down. Again, out, cross, out, cross. Out, cross, up, down. Again, out, cross, out, cross, out, cross. One more time. Out, cross, out, cross, out, cross, up. Put it together. Front, back, front, back, front, back, up, down, out, cross, out, cross, out, cross, up, front, back, front, back, front, back, front, back, up. Last time, out, cross, out, cross, out, cross, up, and down. Great job. Have a seat. Please grab some water. Pick up your weights. So the last thing we're going to be working on is some strength training in your upper body. We're going to start off with a bend and drop. Bend and drop, or we'll just say up, down. So we're going to start off, make sure your knuckles are straight ahead. And again, like everything else we've done so far, every motion you do is very, very specific. Try not to swing those arms, but rather to place them. So we want to go up, down, up, down, up, down, up. Use your vocals. Up, down, up, down, up, down, up. Four more. Up, down, up, down, up, down, up, and hold. All right, so we're warming up those biceps and shoulders and arms. Let's start here. Second exercise. We're going to go up, 
and down to here. If you have any neck injuries or upper body or, or shoulder injuries, you may only want to go just about eye level. And that's fine. You're still using those muscles um, that, will not, that will not bother your shoulder. So we want to go fully extended if you can and down to your side. And we go up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down. Again, up, down, up, down. Go up, down, up, and hold. Now it gets fun. We're going to take that right arm, and the right arm's going to go extend. We're going to go straight, and the left arm's going to go straight. And then we bend, and then we reverse it. Straight, bend. So here we go. Straight, bend, straight, bend, straight. Bend, straight, and bend. Again, straight, bend, straight, bend, straight, bend, straight. Four more. Go straight, bend, straight, bend, straight, bend. Last one. Up and good. All right, good. Relax those shoulders for just a moment. We're going to take those arms, we're going to open and close. We're working on getting those elbows to get, whoop, can't see. Working on getting those elbows close together. So open and squeeze. Here we go. Open, squeeze, open, squeeze, open, squeeze, open, squeeze. Again, open, squeeze, open, squeeze, open, squeeze, open. Four more, go. Open, Squeeze, three, open, squeeze, last, open, last two, last one, open and squeeze. Great job. All right, we're going to work legs just a little. We're going to put one weight between your knees. You don't have to add the weight. You can do this without, just by lifting. We're going to lift those ankles off the floor. So we're working large muscles here and abdominals. We're going to lift up and down. And again, you don't have to um, use the weight if you don't want to. So we're going to come up and down. We're going to do four of those. So here we go. Up, down, up, down, up, down, up, and down. Good. We're going to make it just a little more challenging if you want, but you don't have to. We're going to go up, down, and then we lift both legs if you can. S uh, stabilize yourself. Hold on to the chair if you need to. Pull your belly in nice and tight. Up down. So if that doesn't work for you, just lift those heels up and down. You're still working the proper muscles. So together we go one up, one down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down. Four more, up, down, up, down. Three more, up, down, up. Last two, go up, down, up. Last one, up, down, up and down. Good. Let's move those weights away. Let's shake out those legs. Good. All right. Let it go. We're going to extend your right leg directly in front of you. Point that toe toward you. Just lengthen those muscles all the way forward. Let's lean into that leg, just gently holding anything but the kneecap. You want to hold up way up here on your thigh, or if you want to reach a little lower, that's fine. Keep that toe pointed toward you and just gently stretch. We're going to reverse that stretch and drop that toe, just lengthening different muscles in the leg and bring it all the way forward. Try not to bend down, but rather to reach forward so you're not putting any strain in your lower back. And release. Let's take that other leg and do the same thing. We're going to start off with a fully extended leg. Your knee is straight. Your toe is pointing toward you. Your hands are anywhere on that thigh but the kneecap. And you're going to lean into that leg instead of down toward it. And you want to feel a nice, safe stretch. If it feels too much for you, soften the knee. That's fine. And just hold and lengthen. And now let's drop that toe. Good. And just hold the stretch. Good. And release. All right. Drop your chin and bring those arms directly in front of you. And this time we're going to work on a nice uh, a vocal exercise while we're stretching. We're just going to say, ooh. Nice and long, so drop your chin, lengthen those arms in front, and together we say, ooh, and release.
let's continue stretching those shoulders and arms and chest and open up behind you. Try to grab hold. Um, this time we're going to just keep your head looking gently up without squeezing all those muscles behind you. Just gently looking up. Shoulders are open. This time let's say ah, nice and wide and long. Ah. Let it all go. Good. Let's bring those arms directly overhead. Full body stretch. Try to lengthen every muscle in that upper body. Bring it all the way up. Lengthen those elbows. Take a look and make sure they're straight. Lifting as high as you can. Lifting up your chest and shoulders. Everything is up. Lifting nice and high. Let's take one deep breath in and let's say ooh as long as we can. Ooh. We are just about done. Great job. Bring those arms directly overhead. We're going to finish with a big yay. To inhale. Yay! Great job. <laughs>